Alright. Hey guys, I'm Mr. Grimmer 512. Uh, yeah, I'm laying in the bed. I'm laying down. Wanna get relaxed and get get uh get my stuff together, but I'm um I'm gonna watch my first ever this is my first ever reaction to an honest trailer. I've never reacted to any of these at all. So I'm trying to expand my I'm trying to expand my reaches. To another galaxy far, far away. I'm stupid. <laughs> but anyway, um, but yeah, this is my first reaction uh, to a honest movie trailer uh, for Scott Pilgrim vs. the World. This is my first honest trailer reaction, so here we go. Hopefully, because I love Scott Pilgrim. Don't get me wrong, I love Scott Pilgrim. That is my all-time favorite fucking movie. I, I I love that movie. So here we go. Okay, bye. But only because it's Valentine's Day and we love you. Right? <laughs> From the director, the Cornetto trilogy, and an unspecified amount of Ant-Man comes the best video game themed movie since The Wizard. I love the power of love. It's so bad. Scott Pilgrim versus the world. Get ready for the movie you couldn't wait to see, but didn't show up to support. In this cult mm. classic full of so many awesome fight sequences. <laughs> and hilarious visual comedy. In it is a horrible garbage person. If your life had a face, I would punch it. Yeah. Wait, what? Okay. <laughs> These are all bad people. Except for knives. I like knives. Meet the collection of late 2000s hipster cliches known as Scott Pilgrim. He's an unemployed musician who lives across the street from his parents, shops at Goodwill, is sexually ambiguous, and complains about everything. This is gonna suck! Literally everything. You know what really sucks though? What? Everything. When he meets a loose collection of quirks and hair dye known as Ramona Flowers. I change my hair every week and a half to get used to it. Scott will win her like a human sex trophy by killing people, cheating on his girlfriend, and being such an all-around D-bag. I cheated on you. I cheated on both of you. His opposite is a really nice guy. Like a man. Oh, let's do next week. Yeah, he's, he's just a really nice guy. Indulge in two hours of pure nerd wish fulfillment, where a guy with no personality, the face of a toddler, and the body of a stretched out toddler hooks up with tons of girls. That time with Lisa? That was a misunderstanding. That time with Holly? That wasn't what it looked like. That time he dumped Kim? Okay, me and Kim are all good now. Kicks Captain America's <laughs> ass, makes a lesbian orgasm to death, and plays DDR with underage Asian schoolgirls who are obsessed with it. Man, no wonder the internet loves this movie. Experience the definition of style over substance. But when Edgar Wright is doing the styling, who cares? Stare in awe as he mixes 8-bit animation with live action, crafts frame-perfect recreations of the comic book, and hides Easter eggs that correspond to the number of every ex-boyfriend, resulting in a movie that truly feels like a video game that you're watching someone else play. So strap in for one proto-millennial's epic journey towards maturity that ends with him finally growing up and choosing the girl he should have been with all along. Wait a minute, they didn't use that ending? They reshot it so he ends up with Ramona? Why? What was the point of it all then? Be jealous and violent and chase after a toxic relationship even when true love is staring you right in the face? Uh, I don't get young people. <laughs> Sorry. Ready, player one. Manny Pixel Girl. Oh, it's true. Oh, my fucking God, man. Your grave, obligatory gay best friend, and hashtag not your Asian sidekick, Streetwiner 2 Turbo. <laughs> I mean, it's fun, but the comic book is way better than the movie. It's not just the comic book is better than the movie. Oh, no. I'm that guy. Be sure to subscribe mm. for more honest trailers. <laughs> the Man of Blama. The man in black ran across the desert as the gunslinger followed. You're despicable. Prepare to feel the wrath of a league of evil exes. I use an epic voice to mask my insecurities. Reach out and touch someone. <laughs> oh, that's fucking hilarious, dude. 
Oh my god, that was fucking hilarious. <laughs> oh my god, it's so fucking true though. It's so fucking true. Well, anyway, um, let me know what y'all guys think of, thought of my, my first honest trailer reaction and all that for my channel. And, um, yeah, like, comment, subscribe, and all that shit. And, uh, well, I'm Instagram and Fun One Two, and I will see you on the afterlife. Peace out, everybody!